spectator. I, he obviously should use who he feels is most comfortable mm -hmm. with. So far, it seems like he thinks Peach is the answer, but yeah. he might switch. And, and, and the Peach has had answers. Yeah. The, the Peach has had parts of the equation, but just the full thing, it hasn't come together oh, quite yet. He confidently chose Peach. Yeah. He didn't even he didn't even consider switching. The, so the, coin, the coin didn't even go over Diddy Kong no, or yeah. Paul Tana. It looks like we're sticking with Peach. Yeah. So this and is game one of set two. And I think with how how, how how specifically you have to play against Olimar, to switch to another character at this point would just kind of be resetting the book. Yeah. It, where you'd have to kind of come come at it from a whole new angle because uh, Myron would, of course, have to play against you differently. Drag down up here grab from Zenodo. Looking good. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Literally, no move is safe if you have more than one hit on it for not being a drag down in this game. <laughs> yeah, Any move every can be move a dra drags down. Yeah, if it has more than one hit, it can, it can drag down. Yep. Ooh. Oh, it's yeah. a rar purple bear. Yeah, I'll drag you to the blast zone. I don't know about dragging it down, though. <laughs> might, yeah. might, drag your might drag your mentality down, your bracket results. That's true, yeah. Yeah, yeah Alomar doesn't have the multi-hit aerials besides his Nair. Oh, well, he doesn't need them. <laughs> right. Got He's, they're practically multi-hit, bro. Look at this. Yeah, really. He's got three different Pikmin, and they'll all hit you, so that's kind of a multi-hit. Right. He's got the gang on him at all times. It's, it's just like... It's like he's throwing it and he's going to where he threw it to throw another one and then another one. He, I know it's. It's like he's laying down like tracks of a train and he's just like forcing his way forward. It's so wild how you can feel simultaneously like I can't get away from this guy and I also can't can't get touch to him. him. Like, yeah. I can't get over there or away from him. I'm literally in a box of emotion. I'm in a <laughs> glass case of emotions right now, <laughs> yeah. man. I just want to scream about the stupid Olimar throwing plants at me, but. God, Myron just has a, it down to a science. Yeah, uh, Zenodo has closed the gap. It's basically even at this point. It's, yeah, it's a very even game. Uh, oh, oh that's the first special here. Pikmin. Yeah. Did he just confirm Zenodo's Saturn <laughs> into an up smash? I think he might have. He might have. He might have. Yes and no. Saturn uh, left his mark, and now he shall return to his people. Mm -hmm. It's good seeing him. I haven't really seen too many up smashes on landing from, from uh, Zenodo. I don't think we've seen a single up smash yeah. from Zenodo. I, I, maybe even forward smash as well either. I mean, it's, it's hard when you have the character who's playing outside yeah. of literally every attack you have. You know, I'm going to say we haven't seen any down smashes either. Yeah. We've not seen a smash attack this whole grand final. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's hard to keep Olimar in one position to do a smash attack, so no, I, under, yeah. I understand. I'm not saying, oh, wow, the parry to avoid having your shield broken. That's literally the Oh, he's the got a stitch. Thing. You got a Saturn and a stitch in the same stock. Yeah. Or I guess it's not the same stock, but still. Very close yeah. by. He actually pulled a dot face in between the Saturn <laughs> and the stitch. I saw the dot face too, yeah. <laughs> so that's oh. fine. But no, I want to clarify, I'm not saying that Zenodo should be thrown out Smash. No, right. I'm just saying it's interesting that... Uh, it just literally ha does not have the option available to him to do it. he's yeah. not finding any openings to, yeah. to do Smash there. You know, it is Super Smash Bros, so... Yeah. You might think that Bros would be Smash. Well, we've seen uh, plenty of Smash attacks from his opponent. Yes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we have. Oh, it's just like, when you get the hit by the one purple back here, you're like, oh, finally I can get out of my damn shield. Yeah. Oh, no. parries the forward air and up smashes, but somehow Zenodo was able to land on the ground and shield. Now, the fact that Pikmin have, like, item priority over everything is is, is amazing. Yeah. Could you imagine, if, if, if Pikmin lost to everything, Olimar would be a significantly worse character. He'd be Smash 4 Olimar. Yeah. He, exactly it, what is the problem with Smash 4 Olimar. Yeah, you're 100% right. Yeah. Back throw? Yeah. Not gonna kill, but it puts him in a Stage weird position. position. Yeah. He's got phase. another dot eye. So two dot eyes a stitch. But he parries it every game. time. Yeah, he's good. God, Myron's a very good player at Super Smash Brothers. He can Back do air? That I would not. That down nice down air. Down air. Down down straight up. Yeah. You now I say nice, I mean risky. <laughs> <laughs> and if a risky thing works in my small mind, that means it was that nice. That was nice. Get up attack from Myron here. Gonna keep the dash tech and then probably stock attack. Oh, that forward air didn't come out, but he got a grab afterwards. Oh, and the kill barely. Dang. So Zenodo is still technically on in the advantageous position of this grand finals. He's it, kicking. He's yeah. yet to fall behind. Like once some, you're, if your opponent resets the bracket and then takes a game advantage on you, it's hard to that, survive that's, it that. It gets Monka S after hurts, that. It yeah. gets Monka S. I say as if I played a lot of grand finals. <laughs> If I'm in the Grand Finals, it means it's at a super free weekly that I'm farming. And uh, and I got really lucky doing it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. 
Because it takes a whole lot more than a one seed for me to win a tournament. I'll be yeah, honest. I've like I can't just be the one seed to win. I have to. I gotta do something. I've only won one substantial tournament. Yeah, whatever. These guys try to put another one on their resume, though. Both these characters have taken big tournaments. Oh yeah. And they've made deep runs at big ones at, at like major majors too. So. Oh yeah, these guys have won. These guys win like tournaments. 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 I say I've won one good tournament. I'm I mean, talking like maybe a PR eligible. I, maybe. I made. I won one PR eligible Southfield <laughs> Weekly. These guys win regionals and. Oh, they. They, they, yeah, they, they top eight nationals. These guys. Uh, Zenodos won so many of the yeah. weeklies that I'm proud to have won one of. Yeah, they are. <laughs> they're experts in their crafts for sure. Yeah. And I saw a lot of Myron in Smash 4. It just it just seems like he has a different vigor in his character yeah. play. I I don't like the same fire wasn't really there when he was throwing when he was doing the same stuff with Alamar. I, I think just just the new the revival the character received when it got updated. The game is young, but I would say that this is pretty undeniably a much stronger version of Myron yeah, than yeah, what it was in the last game. He, he seems motivated, and he, he seems like the changes have, have come to fit him. Yeah, he, he's, he's like, okay, my character yeah. is better. I have an opportunity here, and he's like not yeah. he's, he's using utilizing that opportunity very well. And and not and not to not to get uh, not to get too sad, but Zenodo is like almost on the opposite side of the spectrum. Yeah, well, zenodo has got this this different the different thing happened to him. Like yeah, the, yeah, the exact Diddy, opposite. His, his Diddy was the character he was used to got a little worse, and so now he's kind of. Yeah. Diddy Kong was the dog to beat. Now he might have to, he's taking the backseat a little bit. Yeah, to Olimar. Yep. And he's starting over with a different character. It's another very very gifted Smash player, so yes. he's doing he's doing well. But I think uh, it's it might be year two. Or, or three, year two and beyond, where Zenodo comes back to getting the what, the same shape that we're used to seeing him in. Got a, got a, got one in Alomar's hand here. It's it's funny because you don't see Alomar use too many of his like tilts and stuff like that. So he doesn't really have, have to throw the pick, have to throw the turn up. Yeah, the point of Alomar's tilts really are just to so be able for the Pikmin. Yeah, it's just to have hitboxes when you don't have Pikmin out. But that's really their only use. Yeah. I mean, it's down tilt. Right. Can lead to some stuff, but they're very uh, situational. Very, very situational. Uh, Pikmin are the meat and potatoes in every side you can think of for this character. Just back here for back here. Just get these Pikmin out of my damn face. Yep. And Zenova really seems like Ooh. he does not want to lose two sets to the same person. Ooh. Another stitch! Just Finally destroys that purple Pikmin. That, that, one that got, poor purple Pikmin. That guy took a load. Right oh there. my gosh! Did not deserve to eat a stitch turnip. Yeah. That's like the one thing I've ever seen be Pikmin. <laughs> yeah. I like Blanca's mustache in the background. There. If you don't know, Blanca's a character you draw their face on her. Oh, that's very cool. Oh, is that the character that always freaks out with the faces sometimes? Uh, I think they all—I think they all do it, but I think, I think, <laughs> yeah. I've, I think I've seen it with that one. I, um, I, yeah, they, they all can. But Blanca's funny because you get to draw whatever you want, and it always ends up really goofy looking. But oh, he's going deep. These two purples. He had—he threw the one away, so he knew they had one in the back pocket, though. Yeah, this is. I was just about to say it'd be huge for Myron if he had managed to take this stock because he hasn't had a stock lead yet this game, and yeah. the difference is night and day. I was okay. I make me eat my words, Zenodo. He's actually going to show up and take the stock without taking any damage, but that's not the case. Myron did not die, and he's putting on that damage. Man, they got the up smash with the purple pick. Did about 30. Yeah, I, I'd, I'd like to maybe see a few down smashes on the landing behinds Myron's doing to doing to Zenodo here. Yeah. Because a lot of the times when he's not landing with those hitboxes, he's, he's landing behind them. So maybe, maybe the down smash could be the option there. But it could, it's, it's a laggy option too, so it gives it gives oh. Myron his time. Oh, the mix! The mix! <laughs> he knew that that uh, that mine was gonna break out of that yeah. with the, the whistle. whistle. The adaptation. That's somewhere that I could have seen Snowdo putting an up smash. Yeah. Very, very possible. Pick my lock. Just forces an option every single time. I'm, I'm, I'm tense. Yeah, I do. <laughs> I feel like the, what, what's to be the said. The double purples, you got to get out of there, Zenodo. Yeah, it, it's just tough. Is that uh, two, yeah, yellow right there going for the four smash at ledge? He loves that yellow at ledge. I think it's the electric hitbox of it. Oh, oh across Myron the lives. stage. Yeah, he's got the blue and the purple. Mare. Well, the purple's gone now, but the blue is still there. The grab. And he's, now he's got a purple. So it's. Oh, purple's gone. Yep. 
gosh. Sonoto had it. Wow, what a great down air. He has the float though. He'll be getting back. What in the world was that option? Dang. What did Sonoto decided to do? Well, uh, the thing is, the reason I like the forward air is because you know, I think Myron was going for a drop down back air because he had the purple pigment. Yeah. And I like the forward air for every conceivable reason that you could like a decision. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I that was did not genius. expect that at all. I, I'd have just gotten murdered there. Myron was doing really well yeah. holding the sledge. And Zenodo, it's like what Rickles was doing, the aggressively yeah. going to the ledge. What's he got, right, yeah, what's he got, what's he got here? Oh, what the hell? He had the red one in hand. I, I apologize. He had the red one in hand, but still, that would have killed how high a percent they were at and where they were on the stage. All right, so after resetting set one, Myron now needs to win three games in a row. Yes, he wants to take this turn. Zenodo, always one to be down, but not out. No, never out. Wow, hitting everything. Yeah. <laughs> Just did like the fucking spin cycle. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't even need the down smash. For right. That we, that, yeah, the, I like that. It's, it's low percent, so back air won't send that far. Yep. I get it. 47 to set 47. Oh, that move Dude. is so strong. Oh slap. my gosh. He's chasing deep though. Hey, got rid of that purple though. That blue is not going to be too helpful for him off stage though. So. Yeah, Myron lets Zenodo know that you can take my first stock when you're only at 50, but that does not mean you're about to run away with this. You got to work for this whole game. Oh, oh, Ooh. but then Zenodo starts the, the down tilt stuff. I feel like Alomar handles that situation better than most characters because of his, I think, that frame one super armor on the whistle. Ooh, out Ooh. there. <laughs> I like that. It's always the yellow Pikmin that ledge too. Stitch? Yeah. What? Three it's stitches of Saturn and a dot eye? But for in, his, in Zenodo's case, he has not landed a single one of them yet. Yeah, that's true. It's just he seems to be getting a lot for he how is getting a lot few of turnips he's picking. Yeah. I get a, a down tilt in here somewhere. Turnups do so much damage. Yes. Oh man, got two hits out of that one. What? That, that turn up? He threw it down and it hit the Pikmin. It hit the Pikmin. He just disappeared. Because he would he would have died if he got hit by that by that turn up. Because yeah. he just got followed up by like a forward air. Yep. The down throw turn up is definitely yeah. going to lead to a forward air. So yeah, Myron literally living because of that one Pikmin interaction. Yeah. I shouldn't say definitely, but it's very likely. very very likely. Yeah. Three. He's winning now. He, he he's has, got three. He has triple three purple. Purple Pikmin. Dude, the triple purple. Is that allowed? <laughs> like, is, like, do the TOs allow that? <laughs> yeah. Ban Triperple. Yeah. Dude, if I main Alamar, I'd make my tag Triperple. That's a great tag. Yeah. And now I feel dumb for saying it three times in a row, but... Wink. Winky turn up. 18 damage that turn up did. Wow. It's, the it's one of the first turn I've actually seen him been able to get in on inside of Myron. Like, it's just... It, it, like, he gets a lot of turn ups, yeah, and they do a lot of damage, but... Where are they going? They're, they're just disappearing as this soon as they hit This is literally dead even. It's 56.9 to 56.8. Oh, he is playing with a Pikmin. He's playing with the, the turnips now, too. Wow, Z yeah, Zenodo is literally not playing the game. <laughs> <laughs> he, he <laughs> no, he is not. Yeah, he's back now, though. All right. Parries the God, purple. it is so scary when he's approaching this Pikmin. Especially when you have your back to the wall like that. Yep. Oh, Nair? Yeah. Right. I, I, that Nair's an easy tech. As, soon, if you, as long as you go in. Yeah. Oh, barely. All right, so Zenodo, the air dodge. Zenodo the air can dodge. win this tournament if he makes it back to the stage. Never mind. Myron Ooh. has D's. He, uh, he, he up beat trying to chase him out with yeah. that, and then he just ran up the think He just bet it all. Like, if I can hit Zenodo before I die, he'll, he'll die. die. Yeah. And then I'll make the next game. But that's that's a way to go, though. Zenodo air dodged, and Myron was like, this is my opportunity. But he weaved back.